So we just received some absolutely insane news on the anticipated mobile game Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. Soon we are going to be getting a full global release date and it's definitely going to be launching in spring 2024. Okay, so the head of Warzone Mobile, Chris Plummer, dropped the video yesterday which uh, details some interesting news. Let's check it out. Thanks for joining and happy holidays. You know, last time we reached out, it was at Call of Duty Next, which was a big franchise event. You got to see some details on Warzone Mobile and of course other titles in the franchise like Modern Warfare 3. At the time we had revealed Rebirth Earth Island and Resurgence gameplay, yes. our gear up menu and a few Looks other sick. things. And just want to take some time now before we close out the year to just give a little update on, on where we are. First, it's just been huge the amount of feedback and input from the community that we've been able to incorporate into Literally, the game. We, thank we are you so ready much for this for game. You know, I was looking at some of the footage from way back when we first uh, started our limited release. And yeah, it's damn, pretty look, wild how far the game Look at come. it back then. Look at the, the, game, the detail. The polish, look how far the they've come the in the space of a year with the detail and the graphics now, of the Warzone Mobile. Feel, the feedback when you're playing, the fluidity, enemy detection, just all these things you know, we've been focusing on as your feedback has been rolling in. And we think the game's a, a whole lot better as a result. So many things around performance and 100%. device support and making sure it's not heating up your device too much, You know, the battery management, just all these things have been continuing to improve too. And where we are now is like, you know, we're at the end of that, uh, almost the end of that limited release journey. We've had over a thousand bugs fixed, you know, more than a dozen major updates, lots of improvements to everything from the download experience and how fast you can get into the game and time to fun um, to you know, the responsiveness and the look and feel of the game and, and how awesome the weapons um, oh my know, god, it you know, actually looks so much better. And, and you get into combat. We're now in a whole new chapter, literally, which is um, with Modern Warfare 3's release and the new Season 1 that just launched. We've now made our first chapter transition. And what's exciting about Warzone Mobile is, as every new major Call of Duty release comes into the market, you know, we're sharing in that content. We have a connected battle pass. We have shared bundles. We have a progression that's shared. Now that there's a whole new chapter with Modern Warfare 3, we're also plugged into that content for the first time ever on a new Call of Duty title. And as we look into the future, it's something you can look forward to. Whenever a new major Call of Duty release comes out, we'll be able to share in that content on Warzone Mobile. We also have a new feature called the Arsenal Hell Store yes. that allows you to go in and unlock uh, content that you might have missed in the previous title. So if you might have missed a killstreak or something in uh, Modern Warfare 2, uh, we have a feature now in the Arsenal Store that allows so you to, to you go and unlock that from as well. The Arsenal Store is a great addition now. It gives you even more content to unlock. You don't have to pay for that content. You earn those Arsenal tokens oh through God, there events, are be so through challenges, many weapons and weapons through battle pass and other forms of play. So we're really excited about that uh, feature that's now live as part of our chapter change as we refine it for the final push to worldwide launch. Speaking of, you know, that's right around the corner. At Call of Duty Next, we talked about the worldwide release coming in spring of 2024. And the team is very okay. focused right now on the final polish, the final push towards that worldwide launch. You'll see things like brand new big features coming in less frequently now because the team is really focused on polish, Good. really focused on performance, on bug fixing, all, all those want. little things that just kind of and optimization. make the game feel airtight and, and Damn, see, look how many bugs they fix already launch. in the game. We have a couple They are making sure this game is still, perfect. Uh, but, um, you know, I, I think right now we're just feeling really good about how the game is playing, how it feels, how we're you know, seeing players engage with it. Uh, and we're looking forward to now with this chapter transition and now a new set of limited release players coming in from Germany, which has just opened up for limited release. So we're looking forward to widening our audience now in limited release to, as we make some of the final checks. We might go one more territory before we finally announce our worldwide launch, which will be coming in the new year. So stay tuned for that. We look forward to touching base when we make our announcement for the worldwide launch date. And in the meantime, stay tuned and uh, we will keep you up to date. Thank you very much and have a great holiday. Okay, so 
basically, boys, what we gathered from that is that there's not going to be any more huge updates coming to Warzone Mobile. There's going to be literally just be optimizations, polishing the game. What you see right now is basically going to be what you get in the global launch, apart from it's going to look a lot more polished and a lot more clean. It sounds like from that message that they are going to be announcing the global release date in January sometime. Not that it's coming in January, they're going to give us a date in January. And we did say before, it's going to be coming springtime. So that could be anywhere from March until June next year. So right now, this is what the game currently looks like. They've updated the lobby screen as well. You can see I've got the brand new Battle Pass uh, from Modern Warfare 3, the 100% oh, Battle Pass skin. It looks sick. The flame effects, yeah, it doesn't look as great yet, but overall, the skin looks good. All in all, guys, this game is looking better and better and better. And as you heard from Chris, he's basically just going to be polishing the game and the team is just going to be polishing the game ready for that global launch. We're going to get a date in January. So this is what Warzone Mobile is looking like right now. You can see it looks 10 times better than what it looked a while ago. Whoa, I'm getting literally botted already. Okay, GG. So Warzone Mobile, again, we should be getting a date around sort of January time. This is the new Swarm SMG, by the way. Literally one of the best SMGs right now in Modern Warfare 3. Everyone's using it. It's an absolute beast. And uh, yeah, basically, I mean, look at the game. All they're going to be doing now is just polishing the game, improving the, the device capabilities, and I think this game is just going to be amazing when it actually comes out. In my personal prediction, I think it's going to come out anywhere between sort of March and April. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Hit a like, you know, drop a comment down below. I'm going to be doing a lot more content on Warzone Mobile leading up to the launch now because we're going to have a, an official date, so I'll be giving you guys so much more content. Again, as a content creator, this past year in mobile has been kind of dead. It's been kind of dead, right? Um, there's not been many, too many mobile games that have come out, apart from Arena Breakout and Farlight. And, uh, you know, the community just need, need a new game. We need a new game to grind. And you just got bot. And, uh, yeah, we need a new game to grind. And Warzone Mobile is going to be the next one. So I think it's going to be huge. And I think I just bugged out or... No, I think I just lost signal. Yeah, my tablet died. So... That's basically it, guys. Uh, I'll leave the video there. You saw a bit of gameplay on what Warzone Mobile looks like. I'm going to be bringing you guys a lot more content. So thank you so much for subbing. Thank you for keeping up. And um, get ready for the global launch date in January, baby. Peace.